one I've come on to show you some happy mail and some winnings from a give, little giveaway that I won this week. First is from the lovely Dee, Betsy Doodle. I'll leave a link to Dee's channel in the description down below. I was very lucky to win one of the little dies that she bought from the range recently at a bargain price. I'll go along to the video and watch. It really is a lovely haul and an ATC as well. So I've been sent the unicorn die. Beautiful little unicorn. Lovely little size. The perfect sort of ATC size. You could make a magical ATC. Beautiful. Thank you, Dee. And also gorgeous ATC. She showed she had a collection of these that she'd made. I think the, the backing was some wrapping paper or packaging. And then she's gone round that with some silver embossing powder. We've got a lovely image here of a little fairy on it, like a cherry branch there. It says be kind and there's some thread. I love this. I need to do more of this, putting the thread behind the, the focal image. I think it makes a really lovely effect. And we've got some little gems that are stuck into sort of like nouveau drops pushed into those. They're beautiful. And it just says June 2023, Vintage Fairy, and it's three of ten. It says, to Andrea, congrats on being a winner in the little giveaway. L Love and hugs, D. Betsy Doodle. So thank you very much for that, Dee. I was chuffed to bits when, when, I, when I couldn't, nobody guessed it right, though, did they? The, the fact that these were only a penny. Were they a penny or three pence? I can't remember now, but um, I must go along to my range to see if they've got um, some in there. I don't think they do, but because um, I was there just sort of last week, but we're off another look. So thank you so much for that day. And this happy mail, very naughty little piece of happy mail, has come from the Crafty Seas from Maureen and Ashley. Thank you very much indeed. I, I was shocked. I knew straight away when I saw the, the stamping on the outside of this. Like, this is from Maureen and Ashley. And in a recent video, they showed their seaside tag for Ashley's Tag Club and they'd used an image of a stamped image of fish and chips and I commented on that saying what a great stamp that was it really was I was I don't wonder where they've got that from and it's from one of the craft magazines but I did look into actually seeing if I could buy the magazine um, on craft stash but it is out of stock um, but the ladies very kindly said they would send me some stamped images well this is more than just a few stamped images inside here move this to the side we've got a little jar with a little shell on there and i've actually opened it and i have had a little look so i've got a card here which has got lots of stamping it says queen of hearts on there inside here they've sent me an atc which is Got lots of cogs sort of embossed into the paper there. Time heals, what reason cannot. And on the back it says the crafty seas. It says Maureen's birthday is on the 25th of January and Ashley's is on the 19th of August. And it says time heals. That's beautiful. Thank you for that. That's an ATC for my collection along with the one from D. And it says Queen of Hearts on the card. Stunning card, a lovely red base. And it says, to Andrea, hope you can use these stamps in your crafting. The little bottle contains four sand we made using grit and mica powder. Happy crafting, Ashley and Maureen, in the Crafty Seas. Thank you so much. So this is, it's got mica powder and grit in it. It's a lovely copper, coppery colour. I love these little jars. I've seen these in the works. You can put all sorts in them, can't you? You can put sequins and beads and perfect for things like that. And they've actually sent me the tag that they made in the, the challenge. Look at that. It's absolutely stunning. And look at this. I, that was a good tip. They said this was from um, oranges. You know, the, the, the bags that they come in and we get oranges. So I'm going to save some of that because that's perfect. That would have been really good on my tag too. Says, you're the fish to my chips and there it is absolutely stunning little stamp look i think that's brilliant and the, the thread around there the 
twine makes it look like a what's the ship's wheel sort of a life ring yeah on there on the back it says take me to the ocean and it's got a little pocket in the back and inside here oh, we've got lots and bits bits and pieces in here so we've got a cut out of the sentiment and this one says sandy toes and salty kisses and we've got an anchor some rope and then quite a little fish on there and then oh, I love lighthouses oh there's two of those and they've been coloured in as well they're beautiful and we've got a little stamp of the pelican and we've got some just two of those three of those and a little image with the deck chairs on the beach they're beautiful and they're Love using those, thank you so much. I love that. I can't go over you the fact you sent me that. And then in here, a couple of bits of grit out of that bottle, maybe there. And then in this bag here, which I can use the bag as well, I can cover that. I have the images of the fish and chips that I can fussy cut out, colour in and fussy cut. Look at that, a little, even got a little slice of lemon on there. And then the sentiment as well, you know, the fish to my chips. <laughs> Brilliant, lovely. Thank you so much. I was just expecting some of these, like you promised, but you've sent all this as well. So thank you very much, Maureen and Ashley. Um, I'll leave a link to their channel down below. So I'll leave a link to their video showing how they made this tag, stunning tag. I'll have to put this one on my notice board and display. Beautiful. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all again soon. Bye for now.